All right, this is the moment that every mixed martial arts athlete hopes will materialize. The number one heavyweight contender making the walk for his first title fight here in the U.S. I mean, the nerves are going crazy for this man right now. He's so nervous. Has he done everything he needs to do? Has he not left any stone unturned? He says that he has prepared. He says that his body's ready. His mind's ready. He feels physically good in the spot. He's taking on a long-rated champion. If he's going to get this done, it's going to take something truly special. He does not believe jitters will be a factor here tonight. He has built his career methodically to this point. We'll see if we hear the words and new by Nitel. DMX backdrop, enter Iron Mike Tyson. You know he's had a huge embrace for mixed martial arts. I didn't think we'd see him compete in this setting. Hope he's been working on his takedown defense. Yeah, he's gonna need it. Iron Mike's gonna need to be able to stay upright if he wants to give himself a chance. But if he's on his feet every second of the fight, Mike Tyson has the ability to knock you out. Imagine a guy that can put you out with 10-ounce gloves, landing with four-ounce gloves in the UFC octagon. Mike is fast, Mike has great setups, and Mike has a meanness about him that not many others have. You better be careful fighting Iron Mike Tyson. He is ferocious, and seemingly the speed and power are still there at his advanced age. Mike Tyson trying to make headway here in the UFC tonight. The baddest man on the planet ready to add to his appreciable legacy here tonight. And now let's get you our tail of the tape for this heavyweight championship fight. Now for the official introductions, here's Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. It's time! Five rounds for the undisputed USC Heavyweight Championship of the World. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner, presenting the challenger, Quinton And now introducing the champion, fighting out of the red corner, presenting the reigning, defending, undisputed UFC heavyweight champion of the world, Iron Mike Tyson. Referee Herb Dean will handle the action in the octagon. So here he is, formerly the baddest man on the planet, Iron Mike Tyson out of Brooklyn, New York. Stylistically, you're going to see a lot of uppercuts and hooks. Don't blink or you'll miss this fight. The Tyson could be the beginning of the end here. Full guard now, DC. The fighter on top needs to be trying to gain posture to throw ground and pound and then move to the next position. And if you're on the bottom, you've got to build a shield. Try to push your opponent off to try to get back to your feet. Well, not ideal to spend this much time on the bottom, but you can't fault him for his activity. Landing strikes here from the bottom. Nice work by Rampage. Just misses with that one. Back and forth we go. Jackson's eye now closing up. Oh! oh, he's in trouble. It's a right hand. 
Locked under three minutes now to go in the round. Oh, that's a nice strike. He's got to start kicking, kicking the body, kicking the head. He's just got to start kicking. Oh. And there it is! Oh, God! I mean, you got to be kidding me. Everybody here inside this arena digesting what they just saw. That is not a TKO, folks. That is a clean knockout result tonight. I mean, just wow. What a performance by this young man knocking his opponent out with a single shot like that. Bruce Buffer has your official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean's called a stop to this contest at two minutes, 23 seconds of the very first round. Declaring the winner by knockout and still the undisputed UFC heavyweight champion of the world. Well, who would have thought that the former boxing champion Iron Mike Tyson would become a bona fide UFC contender? This win tonight is certainly a step in the right direction. He